Hey guys, uh, this is just a super crazy out. So I just threw the balls out, was going to practice my routes, and I started in the middle. And you can tell I'm kind of rushing today. I'm not taking my time between shots, which of course is a really bad thing. It's a bad habit, so don't do what I'm doing. Uh, on this shot, I barely cleared that stripe, and I didn't plan at all for how I was going to transition and get shape on this purple ball. I just shot it. Now, it turns out I got lucky. I was dead in line to make a table length bank shot, so I went ahead and took it. My plan was to draw it back and then take the one to the corner, but I didn't realize the eight ball was there, and so now I'm in trouble. So since the eight blocks the upper right corner, I figured, well, I'll just bank it to the, um, the right corner, the opposite. Um, and I walked over there, and the eight is blocking that also. So then I thought, well, maybe I'll just cut it to the upper middle pocket, but that would lose cue ball control. So my only option at this point really was just to try to bank, reverse bank the ball back to the middle pocket, the lower middle pocket. So I'm looking at, looking at it, looking at it. I'm like, yeah, I think I can do it. I go ahead and call it. But then I finally do something smart. I actually get behind the shot and look at the aim point. So I use a spot on the cloth aim system. Uh, we can talk about that later. I get in, I get in, the, uh, in the position, I pivot, shoot the shot, and perfect shot, except for the fact that I don't have position on my last ball. So my only option at this point is to bank my last ball all the way back down table to the um, lower left. And so that's what I'm thinking about. I'm looking at the shot, pull the trigger, and hit the ball perfectly. Um, I did get a little lucky on my position on the eight ball here, but that's pool. I'll take it. I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.